Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Michael of MOD Skating Services. If you've not subscribed to our YouTube channel yet, kindly do so. And if you are new to our channel, welcome. In this video, we are going to do lots of learning, lots of molding, and lots of free handwork. I promise it's long, but it's going to be educative. So please stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. Most pharmacies cakes come with a lot of pills, and we have to mold some with our free hand. So we needed to mold a smaller tiny balls. Then we divide them into two. Then we start joining both pieces, especially if you are making two different colors. Or let's say you are making pills that has two different colors. So after taking half of each round shape, I just try to mold it into a rectangular shape with my fingertip in my palm. So here we have our lovely pearl. That's our first problem. I'm going to continue doing the rest this way till we get our full sachet filled with pearls. So let's keep molding. So we had to paint our earpiece of our stethoscope and our bell in silver. Most stethoscope comes in a silver color. That's the earpiece comes in silver color. So we had to make sure we are getting every detail correct and right. We wouldn't want to do something off record. So we tried to paint our earpiece in silver and our bell in silver as well. Then, when we are done, we move on to creating more and more and more pills because we need to make this cake stand out and exceptional. Though it came in late, but we had to still bring out our best.
So after trimming our cakes, we just go ahead and coat the whole cake with our white chocolate ganache. So if you've been watching our videos for long, you know I have a recipe of how we make our white chocolate ganache. Do give it a try and let me know in the comment section as well. And if you've tried it out, you can also share your review in the comment section. So you're going to cover our whole cake in our white chocolate ganache. Then once you're done, we roll out our fondant, then we start making our sharp edges. Stay tuned, don't go anywhere, and don't forget to send in your questions. So we are then doing our crumb coating. We are done with our crumb coating and our cake is looking all good. And I'm going to roll out our fondant and cover our full cake. We did a full covering for this one. So we decided to just press the corners of our cakes with our fondant smoother. Full covering is way easier, especially when it comes to rectangle cakes. So you choose the option you'd want if you want to panel or you want to do a full covering so we are just going to keep our smoother together and push till we get our edges clean so what i normally do is afterwards i use my artist shovel to just cut off the excess trimming so you're just going to cut by pressing our smoothers together to get our perfect edge that's what I normally do with my square cakes covering. 
you just make sure you're getting the perfect edge when you're done you take your artistic palette knife then you just cut off the excess fondant trimming you're going to do that with all four sides then when you're done we flip and make our sharp edges stay tuned i know you're enjoying this video so please don't go anywhere you can also share with your friends to also learn something new today
now have our blank canvas. So you're going to create the shirt inside our lab coat. So we are trying to make out our shirt. Then we are done, we make the color for our shirt as well. Then we make our tie. Then we start creating our lab coat. That's the neck. Should I say the yes, the next piece of the lab coat, you have to do a freehand cutting of the neck piece. So stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. So after having our tie, we are going to make some nice strips, some tie comes with 
nice strip design you're going to create same design with ours so you're going to make something beautiful for our graduates and make sure it comes out beautifully so you're just going to just arrange the strips it's a freehand everything we did was freehand we didn't use any cutter any mode no everything was freehand so you give it a try you have to push yourself and make sure you are aiming higher and you are dreaming big and you're making sure whatever you want to do you set your mind to you have to do it because people don't like customized cakes and it takes way longer period to talk of fondant customized cake but please do set up your mind that it's possible and you're going to make it happen so once you are done you just cut the excess white strips around it and make sure our strip fits perfectly around our tie so i'm just going to add our glue and stick it to our tie then we cut off the excess strips After securing our color with our tissue, we had to roll the fondants we are going to use for the shirt that's our lab coat. So we had to make sure we are rolling in an oval shape, or should I say, half moon shape, because it will have to fit around the color. So we had to keep rolling and make sure we are rolling and making an oval shape. Then once you have them, another free hand, we cut out the color details, that's the lab coat details. Every detail counts, so we have to make sure it's visible and it looks so real.
lab coat is ready and you're going to fix in our accessories. So after putting on our stethoscope, achieving the touch from the earpiece and the bell. So I had to do a stem to attach the tubing to our bell and had to force the earpiece to get a stick to our tubing because with that one there is no stem there so if it comes in it's going to look very really awkward so i had to work around it and we had to mold pen and create our pocket for our love coat so here we have our roll out fondant everything was free hand you have to do everything with your free hand we're just going to trim off our fondant to get a perfect pocket shape then we use a wheel which is a stitch wheel to create that stitch design on our pocket then once you have done we glue the edges of our pocket then we stick it to our pen and create the pen tip once we are done with all that i learned um pharmacies their logo is rx so we pasted that added the celebrant name which is dr dramina and did some detailing on our toothpaste and we added all other needed accessories thanks so much for staying with me throughout i'm michael of emodiscation services and it was lovely having you on board to this point so please keep watching as we finish up this lovely cake for our grad wine thanks so much for